There you go. There they are. Oh, we can have church tonight. Game on, guys. Welcome back. Hello, Alexandra. How are you? service at Christ Fellowship uh, Church in Palmetto Bay, Palmetto Bay Campus with Pastor Carrie Miller. It's good to see everybody here. We have some, everybody. It's good to see everybody here. People back from vacation and everything like that. It's great to see you all. And, uh, we have some great hymns and uh, we're going to start off, well, we're going to start off the first one is 450. What's on the board is correct. I need thee every hour. Thank you. 
feel better already. Never been a better song. Wow. Never. I feel good. That's great medicine. You know, it's good to be back. I've been sick, and I'm almost over this thing, I hope. I pray. I pray. So we're going to have some prayer requests. Second now. hymn. Second hymn is up. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I have to pay attention to the director. Okay, we have a second hymn, and then we'll have a prayer request. Tell it to Jesus. Tell it to Jesus. Tell it to Jesus. I've been singing this all week. Situation number one. I can't hear you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the world situation, the government. And also, I, I want to pray for uh, the uh, 
I mean, we've had persecutions against Christians, but we just have a lot of persecutions against Christians. A lot of Christians are being attacked and are dying. And what's happening over in Israel, too, uh, like 200 rockets fired in Israel. I mean, peace in the Middle East and, uh, you know, prayers for the victims of the rocket fire. Pray for the Palestinian victims, too. Pray, pray for that whole situation. You know, unfortunately, I, you know, I'm a student of the Bible. It's been, it's been going on for a long time. It's been going on for a long time, Pastor. Unbelievable. You know what I mean? Yes. A long time. That's why I want to pray for the world situation. I hear that King John, I understand that North Korean leader, King John. Oh, yeah, to, uh, North Korea. And for, and for the people in uh, Venezuela. That's such a sad thing, what's going on in Venezuela. Well, I can't hear you. I'm sorry. Right. 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 That's a very, very, it's very, very serious. I'm not going to go into it, but it's very serious. Okay, we're praying for that situation. Pray for the president. Because they're all, uh, that's important because um, a strong president can do things as far as Venezuela and Israel. He's we can help, too, but, but it, 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 it takes away from his strength to be able to make deals if. They think he's not going to be in power in a year and a half. He's the only one who's ever had the courage to do yeah, something. Yeah, so we're about. praying for him because he has the courage. But uh, if, if the if the enemies <clears throat> of freedom and the Lord think that he's going to be temporary, and, you know, that's how we lose. We, we lose from being destroyed from within. So, in any event. Uh, any other uh, prayers? I want to, uh, I want just want to praise the Lord, but I, I, I want to, Pray for uh, my uh, health. How is this? What? How is it? Well, I'm feeling better, and I'm on the last. I'm on the second uh, part of uh, the antibiotics, and I'm just about finished with those, and I'm feeling better, but I feel weak. But uh, whatever. Old age, it's not for sissies. I'm hanging in there. Yes, Alexandra, did you raise your hand? Oh, okay. Yep. find the strength, to find the patience, the kindness, the love. Don't take vacations, never yeah. a day off. Day after day, take care of a whole, another loved one. And it takes, I think they have tremendous courage. And Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. I want to echo her prayer too for the people that take care of me. Well, they'll 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 be part of the prayer. The, they'll be they'll be part of that group. We're gonna pray especially for the people that take care of you. Yeah, We're gonna give them a special prayer. Yeah, they need to Okay. Two interpretations. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Better be careful what you pray for. I love you, Fred. I love you. It's good to see you, and you're walking around really good. You look good. Yes, Dana. My two nieces, they're very sick, Cindy and Debbie, and uh, they need a lot of prayer. Both. Do they have the same illness? Uh, no, one has cancer and the other has something with her lungs, and it's not a pretty thing, but neither one. Oh, Lord. What's the names again? Cindy and Debbie. Debbie. Okay, thank you. Pray for Rick Frazier. Yeah, oh, yeah, I have him up on the top of the list. His health, health Good. situation. Good. Yeah, I have him right up there. Yeah. Jesse, David? Yes, uh, I want to pray for my son, David, who's in a prison in Mississippi. Uh, he may get transferred back to Miami. Okay. Also, <clears throat> also I'd like to pray for uh, my son, Joseph, and... Uh, Three of our electricians are traveling to Virginia for a week for training, safe travels. And uh, I'd like to pray about, uh, I'm selling my house, how uh, things, uh, business surrounding that. Great. I have uh, two clients that are, I really like them, they're nice people, and uh, one's name is Alice. 
uh, and uh, she has four children, and the other's name is Romy, R-O-M-Y. Prayers for Alice and Romy, and for strength, spiritual strength. Uh, uh, yeah. for uh, my son's family, while he's in prison, for my grandchildren. It's kind of tough while he's away. Sure, absolutely. Yes, Fred. Yeah, I'm afraid there are people that minister to me, including these people in this room. The, the people what? That minister to me, my family, my extended family, my relatives that I grew up with, and the families, extended family, church families, both this church and the other church, and there are people in this room that are all ministering to me as I go, and I'm, I'm praying for Jesus so he can give patience to put up with me. So I need thee every hour and tell it to Jesus. Amen. Thank you, buddy. Okay, uh, and for Camille, and your grandson. What's your grandson's name again? Caden. In that situation, the adoption situation. Yes, I'm sorry, Jess. Uh, for uh, Anthony Nathan. Oh, no, absolutely. He has, he has cancer. He can't have the, the surgery because of other issues, so uh, also prayers for Dr. Michael Woodham, Pastor Dr. Michael Woodham, and the Alive Again Ministry. <clears throat> I'm praying for finances for him. You know, he's self-supporting and he does this wonderful ministry. He helps a lot of people, works with Agape and everything like that, and they have a web page. And pray for donations for him, and uh, uh, you know, he, he got some unexpected uh, expenses, so that kind of thing. Somebody's phone is going. Well, whatever, it stopped. Okay, so let's go to the Lord's Prayer. Yes, Daniel. All our friends around the world who watch. Oh, yes, Daniel. In the Philippines and the church is there, the Grace uh, Baptist Church. And what's the other Baptist church in the Philippines? Gospel Baptist Gospel Church. Gospel Baptist Church. And uh, and all the people in the Philippines. There's uh, different people. I know there's Maria and who else? And Satine Sakuntala. Sakuntala. In the Valley. There's Mary and Sherry May Mary. in the Philippines. Sheena. Sheena. Janice. Jean. Janice. Everyone. Carmen in Mexico. Carmen in Mexico. Absolutely. God bless them. <clears throat> Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. First of all, we are so grateful and we praise you for your finished work on the cross and and for allowing us to have a relationship with you, a relationship directly with you, with God, and for our salvation. We pray for, we've been given numerous names of people that have health problems. Rick Frazier, you know all the names. You know, if we've left anybody out, you know who they are. You know, Cindy and Debbie and, you know, and, and just everybody who has said, we have Fred and, uh, and we, you know, myself and Anthony Nathan and, so many people that have health problems and situations. Pray for people, you know, that they do well in their lives as far as traveling, the three electricians, and uh, we pray for Joseph, Jesse's son, and we pray for uh, uh, David, who's in prison, and his family, and, uh, and we're praying for all the caretakers that help other people, minister to other people, too. Not only caretakers, people that minister to other people. People in this room that minister to people, and Specifically, people that that minister to Fred, pay for the pa pastors and the churches in this area, and all the people that love the Lord and try to help other people, and and serve in the role as the good Samaritan, which Jesus tells us. He says, "Go and do likewise." And Christians, born again Christians, ones that love the Lord, are are servants, and they try to help other people. And there's so many of those in this this community, and we pray for them, and we pray for the victims and the people that have been hurt by persecution against Christians, against Jews, against anybody, really. Innocence. You know, these rockets fired off in Israel and church shootings and synagogue shootings and all this stuff where there's evil in this world. And we pray for all those people. And we pray that hatred doesn't prevail. We pray for this government. We pray for the president that he be given the strength and the wisdom and the willingness to do what he has to do in order to do the right thing for this country and for, you know, around the world to protect innocence. We pray for this country. Pray that it come together and be united and that the hatred go away and all the backbiting and the hatred go away. Lord Jesus, we pray for Alice and Romy. We pray uh, for Camille. We 
pray for Caden and the adoption proceeding and move forward quickly and expediently. Pray for the situation in North Korea and Venezuela, very, very serious situations. Pray that the, the president has the strength and the courage and the wherewithal to have that work out. Pray for John's wife and reconciliation with that situation and Tom's health. You know, we, 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 we pray for this country. And we, we, we Lord, we, we are so thankful that we're able to talk to you and bring it to Jesus and tell it to Jesus and tell it to you. We ask you for all this and we pray for all this in your blessed son's name, Jesus Christ. Amen. <laughs> okay. Hmm? Did I, did I, I don't think I said that, saw that, but, uh, okay, now we're going to do, uh, 456, Precious Lord, Take My Hand. That's why we all shake hands. Oh, is it, oh, is well, this? Well, sing first and then. You sing first and then we shake hands. Okay. Thank God for our director.
We have missionaries all over the world. We're praying for them. Praying for all the missionaries. Yes, amen. Okay, what? And the mission trips. You're going on a mission trip to Belize, aren't you? And Dwayne, where's Dwayne? Dwayne's here. Dwayne's going on, well, I guess it's a mission trip. Where it's in the a Phil mission trip. Where in the Philippines? To uh, uh, the Philippines. Where? Right? He's on a mission. We're praying oh. for you. He's going to Manila and Calibo. Yeah, between Manila and Calibo. 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 We have friends there, near there. Okay. So now we did 456. Now we're going to do 467, and then we're going to take our offering right after that. Okay. Okay, there shall be showers of blessings.
May there be a revival in this country. Yes. And Lord, um, as part of that revival, we want the message of salvation, your message to be carried all over the world, all over the city, all over this country. We pray that these uh, tithes and offerings that we receive today, that, that we give today, that they're doubly and triply blessed so that every dollar goes farther than a hundred dollars and just to carry the message and use yes. the vision to carry the message touch the people a lot people's lives throughout the community and throughout the world we ask this and we pray for all this in your blessed son's name jesus christ amen amen country. Yeah. Hope I live to see that. I pray that I live to see that. We have a revival. We might as well sing about it. So we're going to do 469, Revive Us Again.